Right is approaching. Stay behind Gates. us. I will hand you your men, you and your men's payment. We'll be free to go. Of course. Alright. Full. Ready to go. Move us to the center. I was, this is fucking cool. Look at all of them writing information like this.
smooth white cobblestones, alabaster, limestone, and marble. <coughs> Accented with gold, bronze, and other precious metals. Shimmery and timeless on the outside. But you know better than most what ways with them. Round your men up, give you your payment. You can just toss it here. We'll redistribute that side the wall. I'd like not to stay here as long as I can. Closing the gate behind you, so I would. Probably a shit of gold. <laughs> so you look around, it's impressive. <laughs> You regard it from behind your mask, and the mask feels familiar. I will be turning around. I think a fraction, I think a fraction of those pillars is more I'll make in my entire life. You good? This is your stop, Elf. Eat them out of the gun. Just focusing. This place Smart. Be careful. Circle or seat round. We're leaving as soon as we can. Instructions remain the same, I assume. We'll wait over there. Correct. Won't escorting you anymore. Seats over there. I've got a horse at the end of this spell. Uh, you can leave it in though. Come on, find, find a map. Let you us move along with them. With us. Make sure I can't Behind me. I want to make, I want to make sure he gets back all right. We're gonna be okay. Circle so formation then. Right. We'll make sure he gets. Uh, I'll see you back there. Get if they try to grab you. Be careful. Pleasure, it is in. We need to run. Take care. We can try. So I know. You yeah. You're safe. Trust me. Well, trust me. We'll act as your honor guard. I do trust you. Don't trust them. Don't let them out of your sight. I would not put you in danger. I know what we're coming. twisted creatures on. Go on. Tara. Let me bear that burden. Crystal clear. This place, all of it, the walls, the buildings, it's all pristine and light. A total contrast to the familiar dark of the undertone.
<clears throat> Good Sarah. These were the two escorts you were mentioning, correct? Yes. Understood. seems now in what could be their final moments seeing one another there is only a knowing silence both seemingly understand what the other has to do Tyler standing here, watching over the area. You can see the two men don't meet each other's gaze. soon. They will be along shortly. regards you with an inscrutable expression from behind the mask. Someone you've known just as long as Arnulf Earnhardt. But the mask is suited to her. Shrouded. Her true self hidden behind a visage. There could be no better image to describe you this morning. And perhaps always.
so many moments of that in your mind. Led to the caves beneath. Finish what was started there. Where everything you too. came full circle. Make sure that our guest is escorted. Yes. Reform. trip down there, accosting Arn, asking him why, why, why did he have to go back, why did he have to go down there and lead you and some of your friends down there in the dark again just for some old bone, just for honor's sake, you know, and whether it was for honor's sake or not, to my right, you know that you went down there to make it right as well. I'm doing it, Arn. I'm doing it. You feel the life force invoked to crack the veil beneath Ledford one more time. And to get those people out at the cost of your own life. The gray hair that you bear, a scar and a reminder of that sacrifice. And his gaze finally meets yours. I hope that whatever it is, it's worth it. It had better be. You and me both. Add attention. Leave some room for our guests to walk. Stand at the presence of our guest. I see. <laughs> Thank you. Truly. This is a reunion I had not expected to see. 
Please sit. I feel as though there is much to discuss. Can it really be? <clears throat> what, you don't recognize me? Has it really been that long? As the individual has gotten closer, Mirandel, you give him a good up and down, trying to figure out what's going on. And you suddenly realize from the crest and the colors that this one's different. And you suddenly recognize it. These are of House Sillaray. And you would, of course, recognize your patron. Oh, come now. <laughs> I know it has been some time, and I've heard that you have suffered much hardship. It, uh, it's good to see you again, my lord. Uh, Uncle. I had thought of you for dead. But I end us meddlings. I'm glad that I was proven wrong. I'm sure you have much to tell. Mm. And I wish I had all the time for you to tell it. But please, sit. Your journey has been long and hard. Right. <coughs> I'm sure you're wondering precisely why the discretion. Uh, I <laughs> suppose, yes. Or it not completely necessary. My nephew, I would have welcomed you back openly. But things are not so easy. As we would wish. You see, I was contacted by a human elven ranger. I delivered a missive from Gradia claiming to know you. I do not know if you know who I speak precisely, but I could not believe my ears when they brought it to my attention. I sin. Oh, the ranger from Gradia? I... A human elven ranger, yes. A human. It's rather peculiar, I know. Many of the circumstances I find myself in presently are peculiar. But I sensed opportunity. Or if what he said was true, then I could salvage another of our family. I refuse to give details, you see, in case the message was intercepted. But once it was made, they described your attempted assassination. I believe it took place in Ireland, yeah? No I bet way. it did. In Gravi as well. <laughs> Seems you've <laughs> made quite a few enemies. It would seem that way. I was aware enough of the meddlings, but I had no power to do anything outside our borders, you see. Not without attracting undue attention and ire. That's why I loathe to assume that you have been killed. <sighs> but I am ahead of myself. Your friends, I am thankful to them for bringing you to me. But I think now is the time for them to see themselves out. I thank you, once again. Of course, my I know this was a difficult situation for all of us, but you can rest assured that you will be thanked in kind. 
May I approach your charge, sir? I suppose that you have gotten him this far. You may. We shall take our leave, your lordship. Please do, and rest assured that you will be rewarded in due time. I ask that you simply act on and faith to look at this at time. You will see a tiny black spider made of metal. My faith. Veneering. Oh. And before you leave, all three of you, I should hope that none of you will speak a word of this meeting, or it will spell the deaths and doom of not only yourselves, but of everyone here. Do I make myself clear? From the very beginning. Lord Sauron. And do not delay, for your time is precious. Where you leave. You had me fooled. I just need to trust me. I thank you for doing so. And I thank you for not killing my friend. Our friend. He's one of my best. If not the last one. You did the right thing. The gate opens before you, and you walk down the smooth paved, well pristine elven cobblestones, seeing the magnificent statues before you. The pieces are complete. good to see. This move has been made. It's good to see as well. From here. But then that's you knew that man. To put your mind at ease, those aren't Iendar's men. For how soon were they troops wearing their banners as to not attract attention? There's a shift change an hour from now. They botched the paperwork so Silverlay men could fill the slot. If things work the way they're supposed to, Iendar's men will never know we were here. I should have had more faith in you. Blacksmith. Times are hard, and I know everyone's tense. Dare you know ill will. You should be an actor. <laughs> I had to act the way I did in case anyone's watching. I understand. No, I do. I did not before. But the moment. That Marin will call that man uncle. It clicked. You were never a murderer. So, some of us have called each other family at times. I'm sure you know of it, as you've been called it as well. But I realize that Thessalor has felt like he had no one. wearing on him, making him erratic. Forgot where he came from. 
is in good hands in my head. As much of a fight as there is for his home. He still has his family. They won't be keeping him. His uncle thought he was dead. He'll have the support of his house now. Do you think he'll come back? <laughs> Arundel. He always comes back. <laughs> Though I doubt he will forgive him. It's the worst hour of his life. It's not fair that they get to live here in this beautiful forest. Those fucking elves. Not all of them are terrible. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna wait for that ranger. I have to talk to him. Catch up with you both. <clears throat> Be careful. All right. I'm gonna wait for that ranger. I have to speak with him. Then I'll be on my way. We'll head off then. See you back at town. Well, what to do now? <laughs> First, we need to make it back to Nortis. <laughs> have to run all the fucking way back. <laughs> we'll just fucking book it. Not the whole way. Power take off at a full sprint. You know that you, of course, can sprint quite quickly as a drow, but you wonder if you'll be able to keep up with him or catch him. You can't just fake me out like that and expect a win. You know how this is gonna go. You you don't catch up with me because of how the speeds work. Do you want to fucking bet? <laughs> Sarah, you hear Tyler talking about the speed. That surely he's joking. Everybody has a different speed, of course. Some people train more, they're faster, they run harder. I mean, it would be very, well, racist actually just to assume <laughs> that every race could just ran at a fucking metagaming right now. <laughs> have you felt like slower this time around? Because I have. They nerfed our speed. I, <laughs> I was chasing Basil out of the the out of Nortus, about as far she's like. Fucking, she's wearing heels. I yes, she <laughs> exactly. It took me until the Imperial Embassy to get into earshot of her <laughs> because I was cutting corners. <laughs> she was in heels. Oh that bitch can run. Jeez. Someone like Basil, who is a practiced whore. <laughs> likely has a very strong lower body. My god, she's practiced. Built up <laughs> over years of training. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Hope a fucking orc eats your face next time you cut off the road. Now you say that. <laughs> But when that happens, you're gonna be like, oh no. Don't worry, my fingers crossed, it's okay. So what do you think of all that? 
I think your father should have been a drow with how many tricks he pulled. He's worse. He's a lord. A politician. Hmm. It was a nice surprise. I thought we were going to watch him be chained and thrown into the back of a cage and sent off to be fucked by a and or whatever it is that they're going to do to him. I'm glad that isn't the case. To know that he still has his family alive is good, which means there's hope in Eshma for our people. There is. Maybe. Maybe he can make a difference. This also means... Fight is for what I have to do. What Arn has to do. Right. The long game. The long game. I'm one of your fighters too, Kyra. I may listen to your father, but my loyalties lie with you. You're not a fighter, Cerebeth. Are you sure about that? You're a killer, like me. We don't fight, we kill. Yeah, you're right. I verbally fight. I know. Maybe you could be a politician. <laughs> Not up here. <clears throat> the closest I would be is helping you with whatever it is your jobs will be. Because I can't cook or clean. You'll be a valuable asset. And an even more valuable friend. Yes, you're a court assassin. As well as a waterfall to the left. That better not be Tang. He's the only one I'm scared of. No. There's others. Not another wolf. <laughs> Kyla just gives you a look. Tank's carrying a lot of rocks right now. Hi. I'd offer to help, but uh, I'm a baby, so. Oh, here. Hold on. Glad you're coming by. Here, right. take him. Take him. Boom. Take him. Kyler yep, I got him. So Rolling. <laughs> For the 14, you managed to not completely shatter your knee. Yeah. Yeah. Sarah, you hear Kyler <laughs> issue forth a very traditional drow war cry. Yeah. That's not my fucking... It's canon. <laughs> oh, my back. Oh. Fuck off. No, it's not. You okay, Tang? I don't feel Actually, so good. God says we can't have war cries because Drow moved silently. You didn't hear that at all. <laughs> okay. No, I was too busy being annoying. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm glad you didn't. <laughs> Currently... <laughs> Currently, my shit's broken, so, uh... I don't feel so good. <laughs> you want company walking back, or... You won't be left alone? Understood. Bye, yes. Tang. <laughs> Tang issues forth sound... <laughs> sounds like it came out of the depths of hell itself. The depths of hell. Kyler, Tyler. you consider all the Shut times you have watched up. Tang... Rend and tear normal men, limb from limb, even those wearing plate, where Tang has merely grasped their appendages and simply ripped them off using nothing more than brute strength. I'll be completely honest, I thought you said rimmed and, tore and tear, and I was like, what the fuck? Kyler, you wonder whether or not the voice in your head would make a, such a crass and base joke like that, and it definitely would not. Surprise it's me. It's very wholesome, actually. 
Oh. The other voice in your head, however, is having wait, no reservations. Wait, 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 Voices in my head. Wait, but now should I ignore Arn and go into slavery? Kane, you realize in this moment you have just Rolling. challenged with some kind of well, with a six. And you know that from experience, there doesn't seem to be any downsides. You've been sneaking around behind his back for this long. That is true. What about you, other voice in my head? What do you think? The other voice is currently preoccupied. Mm. You can hear a tea kettle. Oh. Well, there's no other voice. I guess I'm going into slavery. <clears throat> Tracking. <laughs> If my hands were not filled with stone right now, I would very much. I can't Did you know? Did you know bit. that the last time I had that dream, I um, had a modification to the dream that um, when you throw that thing, the audio follows it. So it would go, a new hand touches the beacon when you throw it across the room. And it was very satisfying. <laughs> <Oops>. <laughs> You're inside of my rocks, what the fuck? And then I, I threw it off a cliff, and it went exactly how you thought that would go. A new hand touches. A new hand touches. Hmm. What do you think, <coughs> other voice in my head? Should I go into slavery? Without being a slaver? Kyler, you consider, of course, for a moment, being a slaver or not. <laughs> Honestly, it sounds like an amazing idea. It wouldn't hurt you at all, really. I mean, it's not like Serenity or Spice or any of those things. Those things actually hurt people. Slavery doesn't ever hurt anyone. Mm. You know, bo both voices in my head agree to this. Stop! He's baby girl. You can't throw rocks at him. Don't get your rocks off. He's complaining too much. <clears throat> I need to get out the slag. Oh, Don't call her that. Sad. Her name's Sarah. What? Disgusting. Why do you have to make bad jokes? I'm I didn't make a joke. <laughs> Ouch. Not you. I'm talking to this fucking idiot. What the fuck? Don't get your rocks off. Rude. Don't what the fuck me? That came out of your mouth. Saying at the mention of heating up rocks until they turn into slag, you consider all the times you've done exactly that. You even think back to that one siege where you <coughs> bought two iron ingots from a merchant right before the siege so you could melt the iron ingots. If he ingots grinds and up stone and tower. snorts it, would it be like a drug? No, it would be like s sniffing sand. Ow. <clears throat> I don't have a nose. Dang, you consider for a while if you should just go around heat it up as high as possible all the time. Just so you can just touch people at will and just burn them. Dang, you're laughing maniacally again. <laughs> You've been talking to Strider, haven't you? No. What? Torchy's gonna be fucking asking questions. She always asks questions. We don't answer them. Nope. Remember what he said. Anyone. You're right. Ah, oh, but they were. She's gonna be a fucking mess. I'm sure when he She's gets not back. Get over it forever. Just don't. She's gonna be fucking sad. Just, just, She's gonna be just, crying just, and all that stupid shit. Don't say anything, and then she'll be fine. Ugh. She probably don't even notice. She's trying to fucking bond with me. What do you mean? She's like a fucking sick puppy. What, is, what do I do? What does that look like? Away? What does you and Torty bonding look like? Honestly. She fucking. She's like. She approached me, and I was trying to do business. The timing was. She goes, do you want some girl time? And I was confused as to why the fuck she would ask me. I don't necessarily exude feminine energy. Like, there's plenty of other women in town. Kyler, I don't give hearing good advice. Cerevith's impersonation of Torty, you notice it's actually pretty close. 
<laughs> you wonder if, well, maybe if Sarah dyed her hair a little bit, you a and splashed on some something. paint, yeah. maybe she could. Mm. Shut the fuck up. You know what? I have to get nipple piercings too. Yes, like then I as said, you cross, lavender tinge. As you cross the bridge, you take an instinctive look water in the sink. to the water mill just to check. So no one's there. Well, if he can't see me, he doesn't know I'm here. Traditional he sense, you dumbass. Stance. What? He can sense me? He was able to detect a constituent of drow in the middle of the night when they were 10 meters out. I'm pretty sure he can tell when you're crouched. <clears throat> yeah, but they don't have plus twos. Tang, as you look at him, you <laughs> Tang, as you look at him, you look into his eyes. Don't you fucking and you dare! See, and you see something. You can see the eyes of someone who just got a natural twenty plus two. Oh, oh fuck! <laughs> Where was that natural twenty thirty minutes ago when I was looking for a rock? Fuck. I don't know Let what to tell you. Fucking hot dog, be a god. Hot God? <gasps> Wait. That would actually taste pretty good. Listen, no, nobody, nobody let him. He just worked his way in because he has the gliz. <sighs> hey, this was the... You would all know that that head god requested it. <laughs> I know. Whatever you say, kimchi. It's because you enamored him with your gliz. Fuck yeah, I did. <clears throat> uh, you know, I'm suddenly remembering that one time that I threw a rock so hard it went through the head of a nice giant. Consider that walking by the mill and one or it's a major wind. <laughs> the fuck? Hello? <laughs> oh shit, it's Venora. It's a major wound. You're a major wound. It's a major wound. Oh, perfect. Uh, yeah, you are. <laughs> Sarah, are y'all busy? <clears throat> no, we just wrapped up, actually. Why? You out here alone. Yes, this is the first time she's going to ask y'all to, and this is the opportunity, if y'all take it or not. Would y'all like to accompany me into force? I need to get something from my home, home, if you know <clears> what I <throat> mean. Yeah, lead the way. I'm not fucking doing anything, are you? Nope. I've got anything planned to late. I hope you don't mind if I glide there. We've been standing for a good two fine. fucking hours yeah, now. Fine. My feet hurt. Um, <laughs> is there a DM run or no? Oh yeah, there's a. No, nope, they're, they're gone now. They're gone now that we need them. <laughs> <laughs> of course they're um, gone when we fucking um, need uh, them. The, the fucking moment. Kim <laughs> you get back here. We're about to go past the. We're about to go past Can't the water mill, water mill, and go all the way to the grove and back. I don't want to go by the water mill. I forfeit going anywhere uh, near the water mill. I know it's in the water uh, mill, and I don't want to go anywhere near it. Strider's not there. Oh god. Okay. Oh. See. Okay, That's so even worse. <laughs> yeah. Because you, you don't. Know do you even know that Strider? <laughs> you know that Strider. I got no fucking idea. You told me about the fucking warforge. Did I? We were this close to almost see. Yes. Yesterday, 
we were this close to almost going to see him, and then we had a premonition from God that said it's probably not a good idea to bring three drow around one killer war forged, oh. and then Tang was like, yeah, that's not a good idea, and then we fucked off. You remember? No, but I believe you. I was pretty out of my- I'm out of my fucking, fucking mind. I am on three hours of fucking sleep. Oh my god. Oh my god. Not to mention I called you, you a baby with pain in order to save your life. Is. No. Or is that not yet? Not yet. It's Winter Hill. Fuck. Oh, cool. Okay. So we can go oh, there at idiot. pretty good distance. We can go there at pretty good distance speed because Scrim Scram said let him know when we get there. Okie dokie. I'm piggybacking on your back. That's the cannon. Uh, Fuck you. Yep, sure. DM you query. Yoda me. For yes. Spearmint. Yeah. Yes. Will you be visiting Bolerno today or no? Already been there. Bolerno? Like twice. Been there for a module and then <laughs> back again. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. So would I have noticed something? Wait, 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 wait. wait. We fucking buried an Arlene soldier out there, man. Come on. <laughs> oh no, I was talking about the other thing from the last time you were there. I didn't know you guys went to the oh, other SpongeBob meme. Well, you know the we, meme from well, we didn't go to, to, we went halfway in, we buried the body. Fingers. And DM mm -hmm. Brunswick and DM. Oh no, 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 no <laughs> not that, not that. Dang and do it. I was just curious if you were going to do the <laughs> rock today or not. <laughs> oh no, we haven't been able to do the trade yet because of. Okay. Yeah. All right, I just they, need to lay one around. Because... Okay, I did not know you were there. My we apologies. Tang, we have to have Tang. We have to have Tang around uh, for the rock thingy because we want to do a trade, but we gotta find something that we think is equal of curiosity okay. and trade value. All right. The All right. NPCs are tracking on it, so just let me know when you're ready to do that, whether it's today or another day. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we'll do. Um, can he can he find something special out in the forest since we are going that way? Just one of the regular arms or a body or something of the other boulders? We found a head. Huh? Yeah, absolutely. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay. Huh? Just We're making a giant statue of my ass. ass. God damn, yeah. <laughs> Let's go. He's, he's, oh. he, you, know, you know what the best part is? He's not kidding. I'm not going to explain, but that's actually happening. <clears throat> you coming, Tang? I'm trying to turn everything off. Are you going to come? Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna we're just gonna go at a regular speed. So oh, kind of regular to speed? In the dark. <laughs> Holy shit, she can run. Go tang speed, I guess. Hey, a uh, quick question, Venora. Yes. Uh, would you be able to make me some flash powder? I have all the materials on me. Uh, just what I've been doing is leaving the resources there. If O'Shawn's busy. The alchemical still will absorb it in and then create what you need and then you just pick it up the next day and then I can give it to you or Oshan can give it to you. Yep. Which way you want to go? Because I know there's a way this way. Yes. Okay, we're going to go over We over could over. go that way. Unless you... Yeah, yeah I'm going to be... Just, just, um, let's go the other way. Um, can I give you the supplies uh, but then? Yes, but yes, as long as you... Yeah. Yes, yes. If you give me the supplies to make flash powder, I can drop it off, and then uh, we'll make uh, we'll make one known that Sean has been delivered to be made. Awesome, and thank then you. And tomorrow you should be able to pick it up. Yeah, no worries. That's what I've been doing with all my stuff being made. Is it the next river? Yeah, it's the next river down. I forget. It is. Well, you're able to go down either river. It's just that one of them takes a little bit longer of a distance. Namely, the one you're going to right now. Oh, well. Should we take... Well, what's the shorter distance, then? <laughs> Lead the way, Mr. Warforge. Here. This is your home. How do you get lost? I know, but... But they yeah, talk but this way. I like walked this. the way of the forest, which was along the river, but... <laughs> Tang seems to know better. I, I literally walked the inside of the river. Yeah, that's true. They do walk the inside of the river. <sighs> so where did he go? Where did Strider go? So one time, when I was little, He's around. I, keep walking, I went to 
attack some caves one time. And oh, you did? They were leading us through the caves and giving us a tour. And I was at the back of the group. And it got really dark in there. <coughs> and I had a fond memory of a play I had seen called Courage the Cowardly Dog. <laughs> <laughs> and without being able to control myself, as the group got really quiet, I um, started making ghost noises, which was a hit, and they were laughing, but I did not mean to let slip out. Return the slam or suffer my curse. But it did come out. And when I tell you I had the whole squad laughing, like there was middle-aged people there laughing too, and I was like, no way. All these random people just <laughs> came together way. and bonded yeah, but, yeah. <coughs> over a shitty yeah, cut. Yeah, yeah, it is. This, you have room this room. And that's my story, the end. Wow. Mm-hmm. You're so cute watching Tyler carry. <laughs> this is terrifying. Hello, dear cousin. You almost killed me. <clears throat> it is a warning sign to be careful. You good? You don't know how recent. Tier you do not know how recent this is, however. Uh, Tier left a warning sign here that there's an orc patrol that comes through this way, so we need to be careful. All right, I'm sure <clears throat> Tang will. <clears throat> Fuck them up. <sighs> well. We run, we don't sit there and fight, we run from you bastards. Um, I saw one of the monkeys on a tree. We need to be as quiet as we can be. There's an orc patrol that comes back and forth from here. We need to be cautious. We'll go back the long way, okay? <laughs> Are you good back there? If we get into a fight, I'm I'm dropping your ass. Like immediately. <laughs> I'll be ready. Okay. I'm just lazy. Da -da. I'm sorry. Oh god, I've killed them. <clears throat> Faye. Hmm. Did I hear correctly that the mist doesn't mist anymore. That is correct. That's worrying. I... Really? Okay, that was a really Goddamn. fucking quick afternoon. God it's, it's only one. <laughs> yeah. Um. Um. 
I hope yeah. that was an accident, because I have a job to do at night. Yeah. We're going there and coming right back, back quickly, but I need to bring out my lantern if I could. <clears throat> or stay close to the thing. What do you mean I'm not able ah. to see the way? Yeah, yeah, I'm watching. Ah. Ah. I can't see. I can't see. That was very quick. That scared yeah, me. I felt my headset was going dark. <laughs> Way too fucking quick of a team. The naked man. What the actual shit? It's an Who orc. Who the fuck is that? Shh, it's an orc. Oh shit. Stay here. He's moved on. Come on. <clears throat> you guys keep walking along the path. I'm gonna go as a roaming scout. I'll stay a couple hundred meters ahead of you. Come back and if I see anything. Side, just move straight across. <clears throat> okay. Looks okay. Where's Sarah at? She's uh, back. back in the rear. I'm sure she'll be, you know. Okay. presence known that she knows the barrier is down. Yeah, I heard about that. <laughs> I think I may have scuffed my sword. Hold on. Oh, there we go. No worries. <sighs> next, I'll bring out my lantern next time or something. Kylie 
is this isn't this your first time coming out here? I think so, huh? No, I came Not out exactly. uh, with Sif when she was wounded oh. that one time. Though I haven't traversed oh, the fog yeah, yet. That's right, that's right. Well, now you can freely. Normally I would have to guide you in, but... Yeah, it's not the case no more, unfortunately. Are you sure? Yes, I am positive. That makes me All nervous. It is mask what it is behind there. So he isn't doing anything anymore. <sighs> okay. Doesn't do a damn thing. Wow, it's it. certainly bigger than the last one. Mm, aye. The one needs to hold, hold a lot more people. Yeah. Of course, also, Mother grew in power thanks to the Ancient One and his strict way of teaching. <sighs> Beautiful. Tyler entering Anyways. this place. You are struck by its immense beauty. Plants, flowers, greenery, vegetation, life, unfiltered, unbridled of all kinds grows around you and flourishes. There is an overwhelming sense of growth here. Huh. Welcome to the Hydrian tribe. Huh. The other wood elves are probably out hunting right now. We got quite a few here. <sighs> quite a few. <coughs> Goldrick will visit from time to time, depending on what he's doing. But if you wouldn't mind, I need to go check the ever apple tree real quick. But first, I want to go check, um, I need to go check the older tree real quick. I'm going to check the stone. If y'all could wait here, please. Do your thing. Tang and Spay watch it, it walks away, and you take a look around the grove. It's a bit much. Trees, this life, these flowers, all of it. It's somewhat overwhelming, almost. The kind of power that's latent in this place. You can feel it. I'm used, used to it. Almost. You're used to it. I've been living here for the greater part of two years, my dude. You've been living here for the greater part of two years. <clears throat> yeah, that's fucking cool. Yeah, welcome to the uh bigger Stop fucking killing each other. Sorry. Oops, sorry. <laughs> I didn't know her feet were so hostile against each other. Did you fucking hear them? Yeah, Just I eating did. Each other alive. Yes. <laughs> this is the big grove, I guess. She really outdid herself this time. Oh yeah. It's like way more overgrown. Enjoyable at last. Mm -hmm. I don't think I will. I never really liked places. 
I'll need to be heading back soon anyway. Mm. So unless Miss Venora no. needed us for something. No, we're just waiting for Good. her. Great. Oh, my fucking legs and my stomach. I'm dying. I can take care of that for you. Please rip my uterus out of my body and stomp on it. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm, I'm kidding. Don't do that, please. <laughs> Let me um, check the ever apple tree real quick and. Mm -hmm. um, I'll wait for you. Then we can depart. Then we can depart. I think back to Sarah's going to head back. Or are you going to wait for us? Yeah, this one. You want to wait for us? It's just a moment. If you feel... Oh no. <laughs> Go do your thing and I'll fill her in. For a bit. Ow. <clears throat> Where did I go? Hello. Where did I come from? God, Nitro. By the way, so do either one of you know how to send a letter? I can write. Uh, yeah. Mind lending me a piece of paper? Yeah, when we get back, sure. I wanted to send a letter to my sister and let her know what's going on. <clears throat> ah. Yeah, I can get you paper and a quill, everything you need. Thank you. Anything. And by sister, no, I do not mean another Warforged. I know what you mean. You told me about it earlier. Well, a while ago. <clears throat> As long as you're aware. Apparently she's in the actual place where they might be able to help with some of the situations going on here. Really? Coracatus? Yes. Luxor. Where's that? It's part of the western provinces. Ah, that be why. It's housed to a sister location of the Institute. Right. Though they do not line up with their beliefs. An offshoot, then, a splinter group. You could say that. I believe it's more of a... academy. Some kind of... It's something. It's a place of study, not a place of engagement. Sure. What kind of study? The study of the same thing that the Institute does. But instead of going out and taking it out of the ground, they want to keep everything in it. And what does the Institute study? Relics. And how to use them. Relic. Fancy rocks and tablets and shit. Oh, joy. So yeah. they study magic? Yes. I see. Yes. Where is this I institute? attended one of the lectures. Uh, I believe it's northwest compared to Nottis. Today's ride and very close to Coracatus, the Free Wharf. Hmm. It's very Most central. I at a map, it was on a plateau. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's pretty dead center to um, Gradio. If you look at the entire country. you would want to be if you look after those particular things. <sighs> Honestly, I'm still trying to figure out how to make them safe. <clears throat> I 
I've had some success, a little bit. At least knowing what to avoid. So what have you both been up to in the middle of the night? Well, it wasn't the middle of the night when we went out. <laughs> mm-hmm. You, you understand what I mean? Uh, just helping escort some things. You know how it is, mercenary missions and whatnot. Yeah, me too, buddy. Is she okay? Don't know. She's fine. She's coming over here. Probably be just speaking to a couple of the wood elves gathered around the gather meeting place. Right over there. Yeah, I thought I saw movement. You will see her carrying a glowing apple. Alright. And okay. one thing y'all have never noticed before, when she lifts up her... <laughs> her cloth, you'll see about three other glowing apples that she places the one inside the basket and covers it up. You're making a magical apple pie. No, it's... I gave one to old Anne the other day. She knows exactly what it is. It's a very rare apple. It was given to me by the Om Deer. It's the tree over there. It's called an Ever Apple Tree. It's very sacred to the High Elves. It was only about maybe... They said, like... The ranger said about maybe 40 in existence left known in Azura. And the fruit never rots when it drops from the tree. Oh, Andy. Yeah. So, if you're ever going on a long travel, let me know if you can keep it hidden. I don't mind giving you one to keep on a long travel. Movement. It's, a, it's good for one meal. So, it's good for one meal. So. What's that? It's the elf. Oh. Well. Mm. Ready to go, Faye? Mm, I, I got everything that I need. Why a high elf? Because he's he's well known and he is a friend, and right. uh, your father knows him as well. Yeah, I know. Hmm. I was doing a few runs on the perimeter since Tear isn't here. Hmm. Well, of course, according to the markings, we need to stay on this side of the river. We did run front. into one. <laughs> 